Hi guys, welcome to Operation Crypto. Today we're going to take a look into Crypto Drop. It is a decentralized random gamification on-chain platform. We'll take a look at the basic fundamentals about the project, then we'll have a look at some of the games, and then towards the end we'll take a look at the token itself and have a look at the utility. If you're new to this channel, please make sure that you are subscribed. Hit that like button and let's crack on. So a huge welcome to the channel. We have not covered Crypto Drop on my YouTube channel before, but over the last six to eight weeks, I've been dropping plenty of tweets out there talking about the project itself. So we'll start off in the light paper and we'll talk about what the project is. We'll then jump onto the Crypto Drop platform and we'll play one of the games and show you uh, how you can benefit and enjoy your time within that platform. So Crypto Drop is a gaming platform of which provides a user experience of providing a minimal risk with a high reward. Crypto Drop has a unique gaming staking mechanism where the native token is utilized for users to receive passive income. I didn't mention that towards the beginning of this video on the introduction, but let's talk about utility. And this already talks about the utility of a token. Whenever we're looking into assets, especially new assets, we need to find out what that utility of the token is because it's so easy to make a token these days and not give any utility. This, from the very beginning, has that utility in place. The idea is a holder of C-Drop is also part of a house's edge. At Crypto Drop, you can be part of a house and receive payouts daily. So holders experience a feeling of not only playing a fun, fair game, but enables them to have a share in a crypto casino. Crypto Drop will be deployed on the Binance Smart Chain, which is a BSC network. Moving on, we need to actually understand how the platform works in itself because random gamification to me or to a standard user may not mean anything, but let's talk about here. So obviously Crypto Drop's game, it utilizes blockchain technology. That is the reason why we're here, but how does it use it? The game is able to provide true randomness as you are betting on the upcoming block hash, of which its numbers are impossible to predict. At the same time of being a player and betting on the block hash, you can also be a stake which enables the user to have a passive income which will be paid out daily and in BNB. The amount of C-drop staked by user will correlate with the amount of BME they will receive from the staking pool. The more C-drop you hold, the more passive income you can expect, which is paid out in BNB at a daily rate. So in summary, all of the current games rely on the random output of the blockchain, and more specifically, the block hash to select a winner. All of the games are based on statistical odds of an outcome using various amounts of a digit within a block hash to achieve the desired odds of a specific game. Due to the new and experimental nature of this type of on-chain casino, they're required to have the first games um, with quite high difficulty win rate to ensure the system of play can sustainably feed itself. Next, we'll take a look at the Crypto Drop platform. This is on CryptoDrop.gg. A couple of things to note. We have five games. So VIP, Blockash Game, Lucky Triple Eight, Two Win, Shell, and then we have stake and my bets. These are bets that I've currently had in the past. To the top right hand side here, you have where you connect your wallet. This needs to be a wallet that is BSC compatible. So that can be MetaMask or Trust. In my case, I use the Trust wallet. Uh, and all you do is click on Wallet Connect and you connect your wallet straight up by scanning the code that it gives. So taking a look at the games, on the left hand side here, we have VIP game. We can just go through some of these these games one by one and talk you through exactly what goes on. So the VIP game, the user must pick six hash characters, as you can see here, one, two, three, four, five, six, or you can randomly select them. There are 16 choices of each. When the bet is made, a transaction is run on the chain. If your six pick characters match with the final six characters of a block hash, your transaction was included in, you will win up to 50% of the jackpot. So that's quite a substantial amount. As you can see there, maximum bet is 0.5 BNB, and you could potentially win up to 141 BNB there. Um, but obviously, you can um, minimum there is 0.1 BNB. Going down, we have the block hash game there. 
on the block ash game this works in the exact same way as the vip jackpot as you can see at the top here vip jackpot 283 bnb the block ash jackpot 156 bnb again six symbols or you can randomly select uh, we also have a minimum of 0 0.01 bnb and then a maximum of 0 0.5 bnb moving down to lucky 888 this is um a game that you've probably all seen um in in all casinos and played online uh, you have lucky 888 here when the bet is made a transaction is run on the chain if the final three characters of a block ash your transaction was included in at 888 you'll win up to 50 percent of a jackpot the two win game is very similar to the vip and block ash game you just have to pick two characters out of 16 and very similar if those two match then you win a percentage of what that jackpot would be so as you can see minimum bet on this is 0 0.0001 maximum bet 0 0.1 bnb and then finally we will just look at the shell game this is a new game um, and I'll tell you what we'll do an example of this so what we'll do my wallet is now connected to top right hand side and all you have to do is pick a shell so for this example we'll pick b we'll then put a bet on for example of and we'll do a maximum 0.1 bnb and then we'll just click place a bet what will happen then is you'll get some lovely music playing you can toggle that on or off and then what we'll look for is a transaction that will come up into my wallet that has now come up now i will click confirm in my wallet on uh, trust and then all we have to do is wait for that block to confirm and then b is this down to the right hand side so what i need on my block hash is four five six or seven at the end in order to win the potential winning is 0 0.20 it draws up at 0 0.22 but we'll wait and see what's going on you win so well that's first time good luck i've now won 0 0.2281733 bnb and then that goes straight into my trust wallet so that's great we've had a win there and you can just do it as many times as you want right so that's for five games covered but there is more to come this team is building consistently so we have a couple of things coming up we have ape slots which is coming up this is a, um, a release on their twitter it is a uh, will be dropped on their c drop platform very soon potentially by the end of this year uh, it has a cool feature called degan mode which is quite interesting uh, next we have a, a lottery which will be using the c drop token the native token as utility and will be quite a substantial amount of burning going on with that but i mentioned towards the beginning of this video we talk about token utility and again this is a lot of utility on this token and then the final point which is very very interesting and which is a big buzzword at the minute metaverse they are building their own metaverse if we just take a quick look at this video this is obviously somebody walking into a casino you'll get a better view there and you'll be able to sit down at tables and play your favorite games within the metaverse using the c drop platform so that's massive as well so that's all the games covered what i want to finish off with is just taking a look at the tokenomics of c drop because tokenomics do matter and that is what we are pretty much um wanting to talk about because you yourself as an investor will be using um the token itself the crypto drop total supply is 10 billion five percent of those are the team's tokens which are vested for 24 months and they will be getting dropped each month we also have development fund which is 10 percent marketing 10 percent advisors 10 percent and then the rest of it is out for everybody else to to get their hands on taking a look at the roadmap is the final point of this video the launch of the token and the bp20 token c drop was q4 2021 so it is very very new uh, but what we are considered about is q1 2022 we're expanding chains which is going to be a cross-chain platform we're going to be implementing new layer one chains and they have special burn events rolling into q2 2022 they will be improving the case of c drop implementing more utility for c drop token which uh, in my opinion already has a, a lot of utility already various strategies to reward c drop holders that's including staking and much more and then we'll start to explore centralized exchange listings tier two and tier one so there's a lot going on with this project the the gaming itself is just one element to it the metaverse element we have staking element and then we have the tokenomics so there's a lot going for it i think this project is great everything is set up um for a, a massive uh, 2022 um, so all you have to do 
if you like it, utilize that tokens, invest in your project, and I think personally, it will be a great haul going into next year. That's going to do it for this video today. If you are new to this channel, please make sure that you are subscribed. Hit that like button, and I'll catch you next time.